Hi. So these are 9 JavaScript projects I made a full tutorial for each one of them on the YouTube channel I can no longer log into. Source code available in description. Experiment with them you may learn a trick or more. I'll begin from what I think the easiest to the more complex. In this project you will learn how to create an image slider using HTML, CSS and JavaScript. You can obviously slide not only in elements but any HTML you want. You may also learn something from the CSS. In this project you will learn how to create a quiz including multiple choices, images, and the ability to reveal the right answer and with a pretty decent CSS styling I think. Yes because we don't have enough of them in any system. But creating your own should teach you something for sure as it is not as simple as it may sounds like. Just tic tac toe. We are starting to go deeper now. This one is made using the HTML5 canvas element. And I guess you already know what a slide puzzle is. But I got to point out that it got a little problem. Basically, the way it is randomized is so random that in most cases will be unsolvable. I am planning to remake it to be much better and more importantly to get it to be solvable. doesn't need introductions snake is snake. I thought I could code it faster, but it turned out that it is much harder than I thought. I am sure there is faster and better ways to code it. But this is what I got now.
This one I did enjoy the most, because it is not complicated yet fun to code and play. You may learn a few tricks also. Apart from the amazing images I drawn and used, I think it is a space invaders in its soul. Now this one is the last project I was going to upload on my lost channel, but I didn't manage to do it before, due to some consequences. And I got to tell you this one is not too beginner friendly. Even I who wrote it, I now don't dare to try to grasp it again, and also I am too lazy to do it. So basically, in this one I tried to code a grid based game with basic 2D physics with plain javascript and I kind of did it, at least in my opinion. I even took the time to draw these wonderful tiles and this alien character. So there you have them. I make sure to put the source codes in the description.